Did they cap those geysers? Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. everywhere. Okay, we froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? Hey, does that geyser up there just get stronger? When he froze the guys, the pressure must have changed for the ones around it. <laughs> Maybe there's a vantage point. You can get a better look. <laughs> yes! Wheels moving and the gate's coming down. That's more of an ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. If the dwarves of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke. Especially where gods are concerned. It seems, Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. It's too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. See what it draw. <laughs> Father, up there. Halfway there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Your 
Think we can uncover that geyser from here? Oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. Mister. We can hit. Oh. Oh. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Try hitting the rope holding the block. <laughs> That's one of Cavassia's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Lad, if I may. What exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. Atreus, might be. look ahead. Wow, now this looks like a city. Welcome to neither of the brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. How's that for us, though? They are scared. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Could we talk we to you for any trouble, please? There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Poor fear. <laughs> Sindri! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. Appreciate it. Take your time. You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. 
Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oh, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material... Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something... Uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it? What's it gonna be this time? <sighs> Patience! I find it's best to see these things... In action! Ah. Whew. There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say Ski Alpha. Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a leader. How was I supposed to know they were there? It's done! Grab them! Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? The sewer you just punched the hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. Atreus, this way. Best of luck. It seems like neither of Valir's locked down because of us. Mm. Outsiders are not welcome here. I imagine that large statue of Odin has something to do with it. Well, everyone's hiding on this side, too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Tavern's got to be somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking on some doors for directions. Mm, let's just keep moving. At your service. So this lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever had one. Glad to take that off your hands and wash it. What can I make for you? What happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. I'll disinfect my tools. And it's covered in blood. Thanks. Be safe! Hmm. Hey, 
Another of Cavassia's poems. A firebomb from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp witch she had until she turned to West Sutton. This looks promising. Right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You? Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Fair point, though. Very well. I think that's him? Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there, and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off.
Come. A boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Darlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following you. Was being the key word here, little brother. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ramir, why do the dwarves hate you? Oh, in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I helped build some mining rigs. What about them? They're a mistake of mine, from quite a long time ago. If you've got the time, I'd have us turn them off. I particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Mimir. Were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. That crane still works? One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfine. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. see to Muspelheim. I think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago. What makes you say that? Wishful thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet. It was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Hmm. Well, anyway. We should look for the other half of the seed. Once it's whole again, we can see where it leads. Ugh! Oh! 
Just keep coming. It's a bear trap. Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. The hurry will be so. Right side. The rig's like they chock a block with materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. If the dwarves agree to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They need their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Hulk brothers can craft something from it. Father, what's the biggest thing you've ever fought? I do not know. You can't remember? Why do you ask? I don't know. So we can compare? It is not a competition. I mean, not yet. them built to harvest ore for armaments, essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Another one of those geysers, but huge. Maybe we could check it out later. We can see it fine from here. No, this is. It can't still be here. What? There's a key on this island. I need you to find it, brother. An innocent life is at stake. innocent life was at stake. Did Odin trap somebody here? No, lad. I did. Uh. 
The ground looks weak down here, Father. That gear. Looks like it would freeze. Maybe that lift can help us get high. Might be easier to break that ground from up there. We climbed over to the lift. Break through the ground from up there? We're looking for. Now we must head to that watchtower on the shore. What are you not saying? The mining rigs are not the only sin I committed in Spafelfine. Enough. We will continue later. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Aesir in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied to them. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. It's got to be the right spot. <laughs> from your blades would cause quite a boom.
Go! Oh. 